This is a 2016 Graves Vineyard Rosé. It is 50% Cabernet and 50% Merlot. Um, we chose those varieties mainly because from this vineyard we found a very huge potential in aromatics for the rosé. So in this case as well, we did not sit with the skins very long um, and we got as much color and as much aroma as we liked out of it just right away. Again, fermented in stainless. Uh, a portion of it was in neutral oak for a little bit. This rosé, mo unlike most rosés, is partially ML. Most rosés are non-ML, meaning it does not go through a secondary fermentation with malic lactic bacteria. Uh, typically most rosés don't go through any secondary fermentation and all the malic acid that came with the fruit is, is, is in the final product. In this case, we took a portion of the rosé and did a partial ML. Some of the malic acid was consumed, the vast majority was not. We still get a lot of the aromatics to pop like you'd expect in a non-ML wine, but with that partial ML allowed us to subdue some of the mouthfeel, so we're ending up with a nice mid palate, but not so much an acid structure. And again, a lot of leaves contact so we get a little mid palate but bone dry and lightly filtered not fully sterile filtered as most of our wines are not. Wow. <laughs> this one we paired with believe it or not of all things uh, uh, banana chips. Uh, we went through a couple options most typically cheese and we found uh, there's a little fatness that banana chip provides. Again this is a bone dry wine so uh, the little bit of sweetness that the banana chips provide uh, nice, nicely balances some of the acid that's in this wine. And what we found with the banana is that the little isolamus acetate that is left over in the wine really starts to get enhanced and matches well with the other tropical components. We decided to make a rosé out of these particular grapes because they were pretty good sized and so they they lent themselves naturally to like a lighter, fruitier wine. They didn't really want to be a red wine, I didn't think. They were better as a rosé, I thought.